hello everyone welcome to quantitative reasoning solution section and today we have uh, book 5 quantitative reasoning so we have this problem we have 4 with uh, with a pass sign this is uh, is very little and 2 we have 16 and we have 36 and a symbol that looks like a V 3 then 12 and if you look at this symbol and this one they are the same so we're working with two different concepts here okay so uh to get these are 16 we have 4 to the power of 2 and let's look at the same concept here we have 3 to the power of 3 to get 27 so how um, were they able to come about this number look at 2 here and look at 3 here which means two to four to the power of whatever number you have here would give you what you have here so four to the power of two will give you 16 which means four times four four into two places and here we have three into three places you have 27 okay so we can work with that then for this we have 36 we have a shape like V and we have 3, which means 36 divided by 3, you have 12. So we can go with this. So 4 to the power of, to get, or to find uh, 16, you have 4 to the power of 2, which is 4 times 4 is 16, right? So we want to find... To find 4, so let's assume this is x and unknown to the power of, to the power of 2 equals 16. Now we're going to make our 16 have a power of 2. So what number is equivalent to 16 that gives it a power of 2? So we can say that our 4 times 4 is 16, which means 4 to the power of 2. So we have our x equals 4, x raised to power 2 equals 4 raised to power 2, which means our 4 raised to power 2 and 16, they are the same. So we can cancel out our 2 on both sides, therefore x equals 4. So the next we have to find to find two we have a uh, four to the power of we do not know assume it's x then we have our uh, sixteen. So we're going to make this side both side equivalent, which means we're going to get a base 4 and 4 here. So we have our 4 raised to the power of x equals 4 raised to the power of 2 gives us um, gives this as 4. So to the power of 2. So our 4 will cancel out on both sides. So our x equals 2. So that's how we get our 2. Alright. So let's do this. For this we have our th to get 12 we have 36 divided by 3 is 12 and to find 36 we have 12 times 3 is 36 and to find 3 we have 36 divided by 12 equals 3. So do well to subscribe to this channel for more quantitative reasoning solutions. Bye.